but not a dog to be left in the house when you leave. They're a dog that should be outside to guard the place because if not, they're going to go through the screen or the door or the window to get out if there's a threat and you're not home to let them out. So it's just consider the, the strength, the character, um, and the personality of the breed. And if, it, if it's what you're looking for, it can be a fantastic dog. Um, but you have to, you know, choose the right dog for the right situation and be sure you're, you're the right owner. The veterinarian developed dog DNA test. Not an ad, by the way. You get it out and it's got this like cool, you know, gene looking uh, aesthetic. The world leader in canine genetics. Unleash your dog's story. You consent to your dog's story being shared? No. What's your dog's name? Oh, f do the dog's name first. Here are the names that I like. In no particular order. Funduk means hazelnut in Turkish. Aslan means lion in Turkish. Bear. And last but not least, Big Bertha. Oh, she's waking up. Uh-oh. Kaya sounds more feminine than others. Ironic because Kaya means a rock and it's like usually a, a, a male name, but Caller Lucy or Hazel, Dr. Mike's Mastiff is named Bear. See, I'm going to pause this here for a second, and I need to explain something to you. I can't begin to tell you how little I give a sh about what Dr. Mike, what kind of dog Dr. Mike has, and what kind of name that Dr. Mike has named his uh, dog, okay? I don't know why you keep bringing this up. Like, who the, half of this chat doesn't even know who the f Dr. Mike is. What do you mean? The name Kaya rock or boulder in Turkish now has well, let me just like zoom into her a little bit with over 10,000 votes is the clear winner at 10,146 votes the name Kaya the Turkish name for boulder has it in second place, we have twenty at 22% with 4,347 votes, Kuma, which is bear for Japanese, bear in Japanese. And at third place is Aslan, Aslan or lion in Turkish, at 10% of the vote with 1,955. In, third, in fourth place, we have bear, which is bear in English, with 9% of the vote with 1,000... 744 votes and at last but not least well i guess least for you guys was funduk which is hazelnut in turkish with 1167 votes ladies and gentlemen with 52 percent of the votes this is a democracy after all kaya has it Although I originally said uh, in a, a TikTok that I believe went viral that I would name my firstborn Kaya, it seems to me like it seems to me like this little fur baby is going to steal that name.